I am concerned about President Trump's impact on transatlantic relations and it's not only me, I would say it's more or less a, a general German perceptions. What we have had to experience in recent months and in the recent year is that obviously President Trump does not that much care for his allies, he does not make a huge difference between allies and opponents, look at South Korea, how he treated them, look at Canada and perhaps I would say the trade issue where he claimed to, to, to wage a trade war and said it could be easily won by the Americans uh, against Germany and others and the cancellation, the withdrawal of the international system. It started uh, from the withdrawal of the Paris Climate Accord and then it ended uh, now in the meantime with the cancellation and the withdrawal from the uh, Joint and Comprehensive Plan of Action, so the nuclear uh, treat, uh, uh, treaty with Iran. This was done, uh, I would say, unilaterally. It was not really done in, uh, after a serious consultation with his allies and it heavily and fundamentally contradicts uh, the approach the Europeans as the neighbor of Iran pursues, so it really drove a rift uh, between the United States and the Europeans with regard uh, to the Middle East as a major hotspot of conflicts and war. Uh, we want, as Germans, want to see a united and a strong European Union we have a consensus, I would say an 80% consensus in Germany, that given the turmoil, the chaos, the aggression of Putin, the unpredictability of the American president, and the chaos and wars in the Middle East, this should be the hour of Europe. Unfortunately, it's not the, the, the hour of Europe because we are internally divided there are rifts and, and divides and different interests regarding different uh, topics and issues. So we want and are determined to contribute to European unity. I think what is ahead of us and which, what is crucial is to develop Europe as a foreign policy actor. We have to serve for our own purposes because we have made the experience that nobody else does it. So we have to do it on our own. I would very much wish and I'm working for a, a, a determination and a will of my country, Germany, that we, did, that we contribute to the rise of the European Union and Europe to, a, to, becoming, to becoming an adult in international relations. I have to say that we have to catch up in Germany. Um, I have to beg for some understanding. It's only four years, for, for a few years now, that Germany has been asked to live up to a higher degree of international commitment and engagement. I think we have catched up, but not sufficiently and not enough. So we have to do more, we have to better explain to our people uh, that we have now a new amount of responsibility, that there is an expectation uh, on us as a stable, economically, politically stable country. So yes, we have to become adults, uh, not as Germans alone, but as Germany as part of the European Union and we should contribute more than we do.